steam a rum city bum city bum city bum a rum city bum city bum city bum round and round went the bloody great wheel a rum city bum city bum city bum round and round went the bloody great wheel a rum city bum city bum city bum round and round went the bloody great wheel in and out went the prick of steel a rum city bum city bum city bum a rum city bum city bum city bum right we change the atmosphere now <laughs> now you need to join in yep. with this because this is a choral i want chorus on this okay okay so now we come to the tragic bit a rum titty bum titty bum titty bum now we come to the tragic bit a rum titty bum titty bum titty bum now we come to the tragic bit there was no way of stopping it a rum titty bum titty bum titty bum a rum titty bum titty bum titty bum quicker down and down went the level of cream a rum titty bum titty bum titty bum down and down went the level of cream a rum titty bum titty bum titty bum down and down went the level of cream up and up went the level of steam a rum titty bum titty bum titty bum a rum titty bum titty bum titty bum she was split from ass to tit a rum titty bum titty bum titty bum she was split from ass to tit a rum titty bum titty bum titty bum she was split from ass to tit and the whole bloody issue was covered in shit a rum titty bum titty bum titty bum a rum titty bum titty bum titty bum there it, was, it is appalling, <laughs> awful. isn't it? It That's is appalling. Awful. awful. But I was quite interested to discover that there is actual sign language for um, penis, vagina, and um, of shit. It would be. <laughs> and shit. Why yes. Do people still have to go for one and actually sport penises and vaginas. Yes, they, they sport do. them. Sport. Well, you know what I mean. <laughs> they sport them. <laughs> <laughs> Today comes Malcolm, hard of hearing and sporting what's a lovely seven inches. Well, that, that... No, 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 what was the one for, um, shit? Penis. Shit. You put, you put, you, you put your dominant hand... Yeah. When, you, when you sign, you have a dominant hand, the right hand oh, usually, yeah, for most yeah, people. It doesn't yeah. have to be. And then the other one. And yeah. the, you, you, put, you put your dominant hand flat like that, yeah. underneath your armpit, yeah. okay, and you mime... Try it. Don't get that at all. Well, they can't Don't do get... No, but you see, must be have fascinating discussions amongst the signing community about how new sign, new words are adopted. Mm. Because when do you think they came up... I mean, that well, is a vagina. Okay, well, I... In, sign, in official sign language. Yeah. That's okay? Yeah. Why is that? Well, because it's quite similar to its shape, I guess. Obviously, I had a lot of babies, that one. <laughs> 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 I, I'm just yeah. thinking that one through. Just in case you're audio only, the, the way of making the official sign language sign for the vagina is to place the index fingers... It's like a kite. Upside down kite, kite. yes. You place your index fingers tip to tip and your thumbs tip to tip and you get a kind of a heart shape oh. and you point the fingers down and the thumbs up and that is... Yeah. <laughs> but well, I wonder what else they tried, though. Because they must have had a short list, <laughs> mustn't they? <laughs> mustn't they? They must have. It must have been a committee thing. It can't be one woman or guy. Oliver Knight says the signing for uh, for vagina makes you look like a pussy was the size of Lake Windermere. Well, th they, I'm glad. <laughs> there you go. Tied nicely back in. And the, and similarly, you know, I'm I'm amused by the official signing for the penis, whereby well, you take your boy. sedentary hand, you take your sedentary hand, and you make a fist with it, your left hand, okay, and then on it. You put two fingers on the back of your hand, right? And in all, and you, you to just for it to become penis in sign language, right. you raise the index finger up off the back of your hand as That's I'm doing. That's bizarre, isn't it? Isn't it? Wouldn't it be better sort of like that? Well, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Alison just 
suggested that her suggested sign for penis is uh, uh, your right index finger. Uh, sorry, your right little yeah, finger, the pinky, right <laughs> the right little finger, just sort of dangling flaccidly from the face. <laughs> and you know. It's got to be said that these things were discussed. Mm. And so there's the penis. Then it's penis. Very okay. strange. Though. It is, isn't it? Still, yeah, but you, I mean, you can sort of see, you know. Yeah. But yeah. this. But, but how, the, how does that she's signify miming, in any way? She's miming going to the toilet. Going to the toilet. And you place your hand underneath your left armpit and you suddenly sweep it down towards the floor. I suppose it's to signal the emptying of the body. It's to it signify the emptying of the emptying of the bowel. Yeah. Yeah. And what, and Blimey, what, my, my bowel doesn't start under my arm. No, but all signing has to be from the waist <laughs> upwards, which is probably just as well. <laughs> <laughs> Could get onto whole different territories there. Right, this evening on the show... Do you want to grab that last call before... Uh, we will take oh, one last human zoo call. Because I believe it's... You, oh. Nope, too late. No it's that woman again. No, it was uh, It was apparently there was an apology coming for something that's gone on in the chat room tonight that somebody was phoning up to apologise to someone else, but... OK, that's... Too cool. late. This evening we have discussed um, uh, whether people should be allowed the freedom of speech to ask questions about the Holocaust. That's all we've been saying. Um, we have heard Ronnie Corbett running a very dubious pub quiz for two stooge landlords and landladies. We've had Channel 4 in and, God, didn't they take over? We've talked about sign language. Alan Caddick's Sports Time is a radio... Gold. Uh, it's just, isn't it, fantastic? Brilliant. Loved it. I tune in for it. Yep. It's special, isn't it? Um, we've, dis we've discussed uh, Australian sexism. <laughs> Look on your face, then. And a whole bunch of other stuff. <laughs> Good show. This has been um, an Alison Mead and Matt and Stuart and Tommy Boyd production, and we'll talk to you next week. Thanks to everybody contributing, either directly or on the sidelines. Play Radio UK now has its very own online store with its very own products. PlayRadioUK.com slash shop. You can be the proud owner of a Play Radio t-shirt, mug or even a teddy bear. There's a vast array of different products waiting for you to get your hands on. All are great prices. Check out the exclusive Play Radio UK range now only at PlayRadioUK.com slash shop. Play Radio UK. Just great music. On the old stream, on it, on it. Playing the greatest hits of the 80s, 70s, and today. And today. To planet Earth, live from the south coast of England, this is Play Radio UK.